Hey guys, today I'm doing a face of the day and a share the love with a twist, which I will explain in a little bit here. First, let me do face of the day. So, um, this is a look that I've been wearing for like several videos now. Like, I've been wearing this look a lot lately. Um, oh, except for the lips. Actually, I was wearing like a lighter peach um, lip look in those other videos. But I wanted to share like how I've been doing my eyes lately. And if you want a tutorial on this still after I explain what I do, I, I will do that. Um, but first, basically how I came up with this look was um, I have like certain colors that I find in my collection that are kind of hard to wear for me um, personally and so I wanted to kind of try to learn how to put those to use. So that's how I created this look. So the colors that I have here that are that I find difficult for me to wear uh, would be, oh and these are all by MAC. This, this eye look is all a MAC product. So Amber Lights is definitely a color that I find kind of difficult to wear. It's a very warm tone, um, so that is what I use on the front part of my lid. So I wanted to start with that. Another one is Goldmine, and that's kind of like a warm gold. Um, another one that's difficult for me to pull off. So I decided to go ahead and add this in kind of towards my inner tear duct area. And then another color I find kind of hard to wear is yellow. And that, uh, well this is Going Bananas. Um, this was limited edition but you know there's all kinds of yellows out there. But just yellow in general I find hard to wear. So I incorporated that on my lower lash line towards the inner um, tear duct kind of area. And then with all of those warm colors going on I, I needed to control that. So. I ended up taking a couple colors to cool down the look. So that would be these kind of teal colors, which I use along my lower lash line. So this one is Steamy, which is a gorgeous kind of, I don't know, what is this? Like It's like a teal kind of aqua with like kind of a bit of gold shimmer to it. It's just so beautiful. So I use that like all along the lower lash line and then towards the outer part, I wanted to kind of create a little bit darker teal look, um, a little more drama to it, so I used this, um, this is a Mega Metals eyeshadow, of, this is Odalisk, I think that's how you pronounce it. So yeah, I just used that like right out here. So that helped cool down those warm colors that can be difficult to wear. And then, knowing me, I always need a little more drama to my look, so for on my on my top lid, I wanted to get a little more like deeper of a bronze, so I started kind of mellowing out those warmer, brighter colors with these kind of cooler, more bronzy, darker tones. This is bronze. And then to darken up the outer V, I took an even darker chocolate matte brown. This is handwritten. And so I just use that in my outer V. So that's really all there is to this look. Oh, and then I did use um, rice paper as a brow highlight and inner tear duct um, or tear duct area. Let's see, what did I use? Oh, I used MAC Nylon. So that's really all there is to this look. Um, like I said, if you want to see how I do this in the tutorial, I can do that too. Um, and then, oh, for lips. Okay, so for lips, if you're wondering what I'm wearing today, I kind of wanted to play off, I'm wearing my NARS Cactus Flower, which if you guys saw my last Day in the Life video from yesterday, um, I just got that, and so I'm just so thrilled with it, so excited about it, I had to wear that today. So here it is, once again, and it's a gorgeous uh, cactus flower. I mean, if, you, if you've seen cactus, you know, and their flowers when, they, when they're when they in bloom, it looks exactly like this. I think they just did an amazing job kind of mimicking that, um, that flower. So anyways, so that's what I'm wearing on my cheeks today. And then for lipstick, this is new. And I didn't show you guys yesterday in the video um, what I got at Macy's, but I was at my MAC counter there. And so this is a brand new one. And also, I did that, uh, let's see, my top 10 MAC lipsticks recently. And so, I think a few of you mentioned this one down in the comments. This is, I don't know why I hold that up. This is CB96. And it's such a strange name. How did they come up with that? I don't know what collection this was released in. I guess it's a pretty old lipstick. But um, 
it's oh it's a frost which is right up my alley and it's just this gorgeous sunlit tangerine frost it's just beautiful so that is all I'm wearing on my lips today and oh uh, for nails they totally do not match like my warm look going today um, so I'm gonna have to change this but this is Zoya Janine and I, I do love this color a lot it's just a beautiful pink I think I should be wearing this one though this is Zoya Poppy and you guys are gonna see these again I just wanted to show you both of these because these are brand new polishes that I just recently got and I'm just totally in love with them so I will go ahead and probably end up showing those again in my Christmas haul because that's actually where they're from um, so with all my other Christmas goodies okay um, so let's get on to the real reason for this video, aside from face of the day. Um, this is a share the love video with a twist. You guys know I love doing share the love videos. I think there are so many awesome people out there that make videos, whether they're kind of just getting going or whether they've been doing it for a while. I'm continuously finding new people that I love and love to watch. So I love sharing them with you guys. So this time it's going to be a little different though. Usually I have like a kind of a short little list and I'll read everyone's usernames off to you and I'll kind of give you a brief description of what kind of videos they do. Um, and then I post the links down below in the down bar. This time it's going to be different. This time it's you guys posting your videos or posting information about your channel. So basically if you do videos, leave a comment or advertise your channel in the comments under my video here right now so that's what I wanted to do that way instead of me just going through and picking through a few people at a time to tell you about I want you to tell me and everyone else about you so I thought that would be fun this time for this share the love video thank you guys so much for watching and if you have any questions just leave them in the comments below as well and I will look forward to kind of looking through the comments and finding some new channels to watch. Um, so yeah, just feel free to, you know, you can do whatever you want, leave whatever kind of comment you want regarding your channel, just you could tell us a little about yourself or, you know, just the basic kind of channel that you have and videos that you like to do. So thank you guys so much for watching and I will talk to you soon.